Hi, Kevin and Sue. I want to share with you some of the interior selections for your home. I'm going to start in the great room and kitchen area. I'll kind of show you the fabric samples we have so you can kind of get a look and feel of what we have going on. Area rug, sofa fabric, ottoman fabric, chair fabric, pillow fabric on the sofa, and then these are for side tables and coffee table as well as another side table. So I'll kind of show you the uh, selections as well. Okay, this is the room board as a whole. So what we're proposing now, I'll kind of walk you through each individual item as well. Two sofas. Um, these are just pillows for the sofas, a coffee table, um, a large area rug, another side table in between these two swivel chairs, floor lamp, another side table. Um, and then we also have an ottoman that will be um, right in front of the firebox, fireplace. So here is the sofa, you can see, and it also is going to um, specify the fabric for the sofa, but you can see the lines of the sofa. Again, there'll be two of those. We'll send you a floor plan too, so you can reference where everything goes. Coffee table, this black coffee table, I think that'll look really nice with the kitchen island selection as well as the fireplace wall. You also have a side table that will go um, on either side of the sofas. This large leather ottoman that will be um, kind of laid out right in front of the fireplace. And then you have these two swivel chairs with this gold base, which I think will tie in nicely to the gold trim in your fireplace wall. And this striped fabric that's very subtle, as you can see here, this is it. And then we have these white um, rimmed and black drum accent tables. And again, you can see this finish as well. For the lamps going on the side tables will be these guys again, it's kind of playing off your fireplace wall with the gold and black stripe detail. And then I also have this floor lamp will go um, with these guys. So you'll have two swivels, a round table in between and then a floor lamp behind the round table. Again, you'll see a floor plan soon um, laying out how that furniture lays out in the room. Going into the kitchen, we've um, suggested, okay, going into the kitchen, we suggested these custom swivel counter stools. They're upholstered back and seat. Um, this is the upholstery we're suggesting, nice and bright and light it is also very durable and the wood finish we don't have a sample of it but it's like a dark espresso again will blend well with the kitchen island so there are your fabrics together for the living room and kitchen area all right going into the dining room i wanted to point out also we have not pulled draperies we want to make sure that we're on the right track but next steps will be drapery and art and pillows and bedding um, but just wanted to show you what we've got going on in the dining room Here's your snapshot of the room board. A ceruced oak dining table, um, this hand knotted wool rug, and we have these leather, uh, leather um, they're like a deep blue leather chair, and we have six of the side chairs, two host chairs on the end. Um, here are the cut sheets of everything. Um, here is your dining table. You can see it also has like this little metal accent detail um, when you look closely. Here is the oak sample. Um, this isn't the leather for the chairs, but it's uh, we don't have the sample in, but we're ordering you one. But this is something similar, but it's almost like a deep blue. You can also see the rug behind here. Here's the rug pattern. Um, it's really pretty in person but I wanted you to be able to see the rug. It just kind of has an overall pattern, um, but the background is black, which we thought was nice, nice and durable. Not a super high pile, so it will be good for Justin as well. Um, and then we also thought the chairs would be a good fit for him. He could uh, get in a host chair. They're not too tall. They also have sides and arms for him, as well as just durable with the leather. You can, you know, obviously be wipeable. And you can just see how these selections transition well from the living room and the kitchen. 
All right, we are going to go into the screen porch area now. Um, we have a lot of cut sheets here, but not a lot of samples to show you, but I'll walk you through everything and hopefully we can get some more of these samples for you to review. Um, here is the room board on the snapshot. You'll have two of these chairs. They'll back up to the glass doors. Um, again, floor plan will be coming. Um, three of these accent tables and two full-size sofas. So if you can imagine the fireplace wall, you'll have a sofa, a sofa, and two chairs. And then here's the entrance to the um, uh, living room area. We also have a dining room table, um, and then two options for dining room chairs, as well as a coffee table that will be within this seating arrangement. So I'll walk you through one by one of everything. Here is the gray rope sofa we're proposing. Um, there will be two of these again. It has a nice coastal feel, um, just nice and contemporary as well. We like the style of that. All of this is outdoor rated, really high quality for your outdoor spaces. Um, that's one thing with the salt air. We want, we're going to go for durability and quality on the back porch. Um, we also have, uh, two of the gray rope chairs for the seating arrangement. Three of these tapered accent tables. Um, they are, they have a, a polyurethane protective coat as well. So they're gonna be very durable. And then this carbonized teak coffee table, you can see the top is, has a slat detail, which again, it's kind of contemporary, but it has that wood grain feel of the teak on the sides. And then going for the dining um, seating arrangement, two chairs like we talked about um, here is the table again has that same slat um, top detail as the coffee table and then I have two dining chair options both would be a quantity of six um, these are all again outdoor rated um, you have this side chair or we can go with the woven rope dining chair as well um, for the floor rug we're suggesting just keep it, again, durable, low pile, has a little chevron pattern detail. We've used this one before. It's a, a great quality and really pretty for the outdoors. All right, moving into the master bedroom, one of our favorite spaces here. Again, here's your room board so you can see everything at a glance. Headboard is really tall, 64 inches, I believe. Um, so that'll give some nice presence, especially with the tall ceilings in there. We have this um, diamond shaped rug, bedside tables and a lamp, as well as a dresser straight across from the bed. And then in the master sitting area, we have two swivel chairs, super comfy. We sat in these at market, a entertainment center, as well as a little upholster bench to put your feet up and then a pretty rug in there as well um, with an accent table on the side of those two chairs. So walk you through everything. Here is the rug. It's showing a little darker on this video than it actually is. It's almost just like a light gray base with a really pretty creamy white um, cross pattern. This is the wood sample for most of the furniture in your space. You have the bedside tables, and on those bedside tables will be these gold and um, acrylic lamps, you can see there. And then across from the bed, we have, again, um, this ceruced oak, white oak um, dresser, lots of storage there. And then your bed, we talked about that it is um, 64 inches tall 66 inches tall excuse me uh, upholstered and then the headboard will be in this fabric so even though the photo is showing it in a cream we are suggesting this nice neutral like uh, slate blue color the base just the feet here are this uh, charcoal gray as well Moving into the sitting area, we have this really pretty ombre blue rug. Um, again, here are the swivel chairs. The swivel chairs will be in this nice, pretty, it's a, a velvet, actually super soft uh, velvet 
gray fabric. The bench here is the same wood tone as the dresser and the bedside tables, and the upholstery will be this really pretty, creamy, soft velour fabric. And then you have a side table that is in a dark gray, and it has a high gloss uh, top to it. And then you also have a little space for a TV uh, across from the sitting arrangement in the master sitting area. And we are suggesting this architectural um, wood four-door entertainment credenza. It has lots of storage, as you can see, and it also follows in the color tones as the bedside tables and the dresser. All right, we are on to Justin's bedroom. Show you everything, again, on the room board. I'm noticing a lamp is not on the room board, but we do have a cut sheet, so we'll show you that as well. Bed frame, bedside tables, two of the custom sliding uh, swivel gliders, as well as a round metal drink table that will go in between those two chairs. And again, the floor plan will locate everything for you to understand everything better. Here are the wood samples. So here's your bed. Um, again, you can see heights here, and we can give you full detail on what the height of the mattress is as well. I'm seeing that this does not say that, but we will get you um, approximate dimensions with that. But we like the contemporary masculine feel of the bed. Bedside tables are these two-tone nightstands, again, the same wood tone that of these guys. And then the lamps are these um, sculptural uh, lamps, ceramic lamps in black. The swivel chairs, durable um, polyester fabric, polyester and acrylic fabric, excuse me. And it's in this black fabric um, that's also very soft. These swivel, so just make sure that that is all right. And then we have a round, metal drink table going in between the two swivel chairs as well, well, just for drinks or book or whatever you need in that area. So here is Justin's room. Again, we will add art and bedding next layer.